Well, from the pan to the plate and out to your table, have you ever wondered what's happening behind the scenes at your favorite restaurant? Well, there are some things, let's face it, a restaurant just doesn't want us to know about. New at 9.30 tonight, Fox 31 troubleshooter Tom Martino has the scoop on the best kept restaurant secrets. This restaurant confidential looks at what's up in the kitchen. Kitchen confidential. The troubleshooter's got the scoop on what's cooking. Okay, here's a pop quiz. What's the worst night to go out to eat? Give up? Sunday night. That's because workers are burned out from a busy Friday and Saturday night. Sunday's the worst, without a doubt. Chef Tom Thompson is willing to dish the dirt on the restaurant industry. He says, speaking of Sunday, stay away from the seafood. Seafood, generally, you get in towards the end of the week. Wednesday through Saturday is probably the best days for seafood. Monday is not a good day. Sunday is not a good day. You'd be hard pressed to see a chef eat at a buffet. That's because they know the warm food is so supposed to be kept at or above 145 degrees to prevent bacteria growth. And cold food can be even more dangerous if not kept cold enough. Salad bar is worse because between 45 and 145, that's the danger zone where bacteria grows. And um, so if you look at a salad bar, you can tell, you know, if the stuff's out of the ice, just kind of on top, the salad. You gotta be careful. When it comes to sending food back, be careful. If you're nasty about it, you could end up with a foreign substance in your food. And according to one veteran chef, there really is a three second rule. That means when something drops on the floor, they'll pick it up and use it anyway, if they get to it quickly. Another practice, taking food that's been tossed and using it for last minute guests at the end of the night. This is an extreme measure and fortunately not practiced by many. So where do you get the most consistency in product and service? The chain restaurants probably do the best. I mean, they're the ones with the, uh, the manuals on how to do everything. Everything is done by the book. So believe it or not, they're probably the best. And you know the best time to go to a restaurant? About an hour after it opens. They start getting into the groove. If you go too early, they're not quite ready. And if you go way late, things can get a little stale. The bottom line, these practices, some of them disgusting, probably won't do you serious harm. So maybe it's best to just keep it confidential. Just enjoy your dinner. Out of the pan and into the fire, the troubleshooter's got the scoop on what's cooking. I'm troubleshooter Tom Martino, Fox 31 News.